Hello, everybody! Welcome back to another exciting episode of Assassin's Creed, brought to you by Mr. Ostasia. I'll let y'all go ahead and be informed by Mr. Cathaway on this, and then I'll explain everything back um, later. Grow restless. They want to know what comes next. I do not have an answer. Lee alone remains active, pursuing leads, however slight. He stalks the city streets and scouts the bordering woods, hopeful that he might make contact with one of those we saved. There was a woman there that night. It was she who helped the others to safety. Bow chicka wow wow. If I can find her, I believe I'll have my answers. So. <laughs> Yay, answers! And wait. Hopeful that my true mission might finally begin. Hmm. Trying to find one of the hidden temples. Awesome, that's awesome. Let awesome. Boston, 1755. A green dragon. Hmm. All right, let's get in here. I'll collect the Almanac pa pages as I go along. If y'all want me to put some gameplay up of that, I'd be more than happy to. Just put it in the comment link below. Hello, Charles. Any luck finding our mystery woman? Word is she's been stirring up trouble just outside the city in a town called Lexington. Well, then that's where we begin our search. I'll meet you there. <gasps> Lexington! Officially the first battle of the revolution, even though it wasn't a success for the rebels. Actually, Lexington and Concord was just a far, uh, um, like a farce. The the rebels were actually only fighting the British to keep them away from the weapon store, or like give enough time to the men in the town to actually uh, clean up the weapon storage a area before the British troops arrived. That way, they wouldn't be able to steal their uh, weapons they would use in the early revolution. <laughs> Sorry, I, I just love history. I love history. It's really cool. And Assassin's Creed just makes it all that cooler. Let's see here. Hoo ha hoo ha. Move, kid. Let's go. Stupid cat. Now, this just looks so real. It looks like you're walking through a revolutionary town. And why am I on foot? I might as well just go up on the rooftops. How about no? I won't go anywhere. Now that was cool. Hmm. I actually love the the kind of sound effects they actually put. Oh my gosh! And you could do stealth moves like that around corners. I didn't know that. <laughs> Maybe I was supposed to, and I was, and I just realized it. So I'm sorry. <laughs> Hello, British guys. How are you? Alright, uh, let's hop up here. But it's it's kind of sad that you don't get to play as Ezio anymore. I mean, I l really love the Renaissance, but hey, I love the Revolution, too. So much history involved with it. Come on. Come on, how, lo how far is this place? How many rooftops do I gotta climb, eh? Okay. Ah, oh, there's a flooring shop. Or is that a bank? Ah, oh, it's a general store. Let's go ahead and see what the uh, what kind of weapons they offer. Oh, this place is lovely. Consumables. Cartridge. Smoke bombs. Oh my gosh, I love smoke bombs. Normal weapons. French rapier, like cabaret saber, French cutlass. Ah, the French. Nope. Uh, nah. We don't have enough money anyway. 
Ah, no, I don't. Oh, he's German. Mein Freund. Goodbye, uh, mein Freund. I love the Germans. They're so interesting. They're so, uh, they're interesting people. Alright, let's see. I'm assassin. I'm an assassin. Well, I'm walking on, I'm running on sunshine. Wow. And dang, it feels good. Alrighty now. I'll no, don't hide in the well. Bad. Don't hide in the well. Hmm. Come on. Oh my god, how long of a run is this? I mean, come on. Maybe I should have taken one of those horses. That probably would have been wise. <laughs> Too late now. Hmm. 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 Awesome, they actually made um, the horse look, uh, feel more realistic than it actually was in the other game. Because, it, in my opinion, it was a little a little awkward with the game for, uh, for like, the movement of the horse. So, making it like this just makes it that more interesting to uh, follow. Alright. Come on, come on, come on. Yes, want to travel to the frontier. So you actually get to travel places, just like in Assassin's Creed 2. Hmm. I actually liked Assassin's Creed 2. You got to move anywhere you wanted. Wanted. You could trade with different people. And a lot of the different things you would have to find are in different places all around the, uh, most of Europe. So you're not just confined to one place. That's what I kind of didn't like about Assassin's Creed 3. I mean, not oh, I mean I love Assassin's Creed 3. What am I talking about? Uh, Assassin's Creed Brotherhood and I mean Rev. I mean they're just in one place. Come on guys, let's go with um a more outward view of it, if you know what I mean. Ha ha! I'm on a horse. Okay. <laughs> Entering hunting region. Scotch Plains. Alright. So there's another example of a lot of the um the pioneers that came here. The um the colonists. So you have a lot of people coming to America wanting to be, you know, have a better life because in I hate to say this to my Brit uh, the British uh, viewers, but during this time, Britain wouldn't allow you to actually jump up on your uh, social ranking and or uh, your ranking in society. Like, even if you were a doc during this time, a doctor was not a very well-paying job. And the only well-paying job that there was was being a minister or what else? Hmm. Oh, we finally arrived. Okay. Have you found her? Yeah, I, I can tell She's this is going to be a little uh, long episode. <laughs> Excellent. Well, the sooner we're done, the sooner we can get out of this cold. We'll move faster on horseback. I'm, afraid I'm in between horses. News, oh? Braddock is insisting I return to service under him. I've tried to beg off to no avail. No doubt he's still angry about losing Pitcairn. To say nothing of the mm -hmm. shaming we gave him. Do as he asks. In the meantime, <laughs> I'll work on having you released. I'm sorry for the trouble. Not your fault. Huh. 
I actually kind of like this char character, Hathaway. Hathaway. I I'm thinking about Hathaway, the author. Sorry. I actually love this new detail that they put on the environment. It looks so freaking awesome. No recently disturbed. She's close. There go our horses. Great. Bollocks. Now I'm spooked. These tracks are fresh. <laughs> bollocks means balls in uh uh, yeah, bollocks just mean balls, if y'all wanted to go in, uh, if y'all were wondering what that means. Hmm. I think I know where she might be. Hmm. I think she's up here. Yeah, look, okay, look at the movement. That looks so real. That looks like you are actually climbing a mountain or some uh, something like that. You know, guys. You know, whenever you're trudging through snow, there she is. We got her. Ah. Hey, it's that Indian woman from before. Wait here. I'm gonna work my moves, you stay here. <laughs> Whoa. Damn it. Wait, come back. You return to Braddock, Charles. Now we gotta chase after her. Great. I can handle things from here. But so but nothing. Go. Stop running. I only wish to talk. Okay, I can't climb that tree. Please just hear me out. God, woman. Okay, okay, I'm reducing t uh, distance. Enough with these games. Okay, I'm reducing. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, great. I've never seen wolves do that before. Bring it, bring it, bring it. Ha. Suck on it, dog. Ha. Mm. Owned. All right, where should she go now? Oh, this is gonna be fun. I actually like this new environment. It looks so cool. Come on! Stop running! I'm not gonna hurt you. Got you. Yay! <laughs> that means you're special. Why are you speaking so slow? Sorry. What do you want? <laughs> well, your name, for one. I'm Gadzi Zio. Well, pleased to meet you. God, God's day. Just call me Zio. Dio. Zio. 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 <laughs> Tell me why it is you here. Like Ed Zio. <laughs> Where did you get this? From an old friend. I've only seen such markings in one other place. An old man. Well, it is forbidden for me to speak of it. I saved your people. Does this mean nothing to you? Look, I am not the enemy. <sighs> Close to here, there is a hill. Meet me there, and we'll see if you speak the truth. All right. Well, that was.
was a lag. <laughs> yeah, I think I might go a little bit farther into this because I wasted y'all's time on the walk. Hmm. That town hosts soldiers who seek to drive my people from these lands. They're led by a man known as the Bulldog. Edward Braddock. You know him? He's no friend of mine. Every day, more of my people are lost to men like him. Then I suggest we put a stop to it. Together. What do you propose? That we kill Edward Braddock. But first... <laughs> find Just like, alright, we'll kill him. <laughs> Whoa, the Indians know. They know the um I don't trust them. leap of faith. That's pretty cool. Yet you remain. Alright, let's see. But I might prove you wrong. Those uh, those are the enemy. So you say. Hmm. So I know. Like I like I say to other people. <laughs> <laughs> he just proved it wrong. How funny. Wait here. A Mohawkman is likely to raise suspicions, if not muskets. This is hardly the first time I've been amongst your people. I can handle myself. Ooh. She kind of remains, reminds me, remain, reminds me of uh, Leia Organa. Princess Leia. Yes, I know I failed the health limit thingy. The endless crashing of the waves, the sting of the salt in the eyes, and the goddamn gulls shrieking and shitting. I think it's so cool that you get to just like, uh, just like sneak into the environment and just eavesdrop. That's so cool. Slap a fancy name on something, and all evil is excused. Alright, so let's go listen in over here, guys. Maybe they'll say something dirty. Hmm. Alrighty. Hello, woman. Oh, that's not nice. And now, well, now I'm going to feed you your teeth. And you were worried I was going to be the. Ooh. <laughs> ha! This is just like a bar fight. Bring it. Bring it, boy. Please. You cannot stand up against me. Ha! 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 Now this is a bar fight. <laughs> and it even has the sound of a bar fight. It's like Irish. Ho! Ha! Ha! Huh! 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 Oh! I'm gonna drop my beer! Here, you take some of this and this! That's a pile driver for ya! You're hurt. Oh, that's nothing. Here. <laughs> Using beer. Stop the bleeding. Ma and Russia, you use beer for everything. That wasn't necessary. Thank you. Oh. We should move on. Meet me at Braddock's camp when you're ready. All right. 
Looks like this is a good stopping point, guys. So until next time, remember to like, comment, and subscribe. And, uh, and until next time, Mr. Ostasia, out. Yes, I know I failed on that. Shut up, computer. Bye, guys.